Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the XWF. I'm the Bear. This is our debut show. We've got four matches coming up tonight. Uh, I've got high hopes of what's going to happen. Competitors, I don't know who's going against who yet. The owner's going to come down and sort that out. I don't know how he's going to do that, but we're going to find out. Um, okay, if you want to get involved in the XWF, then you need to get your characters to us. we got our game tags here. You can find them. Just upload the character onto the Xbox Live Network and get the name to us. We'll download them and we'll try and get them involved. But I think the owner's on his way, so let's see what he's got to say. There he is, he's the owner, the greatest businessman this industry has ever known. Uh, what can I say? You know, look, the fans are booing him, but, you know, they're booing him because he's a better man. He's better than any of them. He's got more money. He runs the XWF, the greatest he fed online. He runs it. He started this business. He comes down to the ring and limo. What do these guys do? They pay to sit down on their fat asses and watch the owner. You know, they can do him all they want, but they cannot deny that he was a great businessman. And they have him to thank for this industry. He's there in the crowd. He's the one to thank. So, you know, they can say what they want to say about the owner. That's their choice. I'm not saying I agree with it. Let's see what he's got to say for himself. <laughs> what did I say? He created the XWF. That's the first thing he says when he comes down to the ring. Uh, he's talking about the Demolition Series pay-per-view. It's uh, the XWF's first pay-per-view. It's coming up uh, the next month, I think it is. It's going to be great. I'm looking forward to it. Again, uh, we don't know who's wrestling. But with the town of Ross that we've got in the XWF, I'm sure it's going to be great. Knockout style competition. It's interesting. So if you lose, you're out completely. I'm liking the owner. He's got the great ideas. People are going to be glued to the TVs for the sh**. Alright, let's spin the wheel. That's Dr. Karn, the legend in this industry. I saw Dr. Karn at 2007 against Nightmare at uh, the XWA. That was an amazing match. Music can land on. Uh, Tobias Upson, the Bionic Rookie. So we got Dr. Karn versus the Tobias Upson, the Bionic Rookie himself. He's new. Dr. Karn's a veteran. It's going to be an interesting match. Okay, he's spinning the wood again, the owner here. And that's Hawk, Birds of Prey. So we spin on the wheel again now. Let's see where it's going to land on. Plenty of great superstars on the wheel. It's going to be in. Uh, there we go. It's Mike the Viper Jacobs. He's part of the tag team called the Masters of Professional Wrestling. He claims to be the tactical masterpiece. I'm looking forward to seeing what he can pull out. Here's the next match. Steve the Serpent Connor versus Big D. I see Big D. He was in the CWF. I saw him in 2005. He's a machine. We got... That's Luke Loins. He's a new guy in the XWF, actually. He's not been in any uh, federations prior to us, so... Yeah, he's being hyped up. I'm looking forward to see what he's got. Uh, Nightmare. Nightmare. He's a crazy son of a... I saw him, he's in the CWO, he's one of the owner's right hand man. He's a crazy man. Oh, we're getting this show on the road! Alright. It's uh, Dr. Khan. So he's going up against Tobias Upson tonight. Let's say that's a great match, just kick off the XWF. All the fans are going crazy for Dr. Khan. Obviously they know him from the XWA. He was, uh, what, two-time heavyweight champion in the XWA? I think he was the only man uh, to beat Lord Lore, fair and square. It's got a lot going on. <laughs> just see a fan with the, the Dr. Khan sign there. You know, the fans love Dr. Khan. 
Um, as you can see, uh, you can buy the Dr. F*** on shirt, it's uh, 9 quid on the XWF shop. So if you want to support this guy, go and get his shirt. Um, I quite like his song actually, his entrance music. It's from uh, Korn's new album, The Path of Totality. I'd say if you're uh, a fan of Korn, pick it up, it's definitely worth the buy. It's a dubstep with a bit of metal in it. It's pretty good, I'm liking it. You know, I've been listening to it, the crowd are obviously I can look at that. <laughs> Karn's looking more ripped, man. He's looking really good, actually. They're looking good. He's in better shape. I mean, what was it, around 2008 to 9? He went a little bit out of shape, but he seems to be back in now. He, he's on form. Could he be the uh, XWF champion? Could he win this series? I don't think so. Not for people like Nightmare, but no, we'll see, we'll see. Um, Tobias Upson, here we go. He's a new guy. The crowd, you know, not as big of a reaction. They're not over on him yet. He's, he's still building his name up. He's still getting himself out there. Um, the entrance music by a band called Judy and K. Um, yeah, I, I quite like their, their stuff actually. I'm, you know, I'm quite a big fan. I'm liking the blue and purple lights that uh, Upson has for his entrance and stuff. Going with the blue hair. Good, you know. I've seen him with the train actually, like still with training. He, he's got some power to him. He's a little guy. He's, he's quick, he's strong, he's agile. But it depends. Can he, can, you know, can he hold his weight against the doctor? And we're going to find it out. My predictions for this match, I'm probably going to have to say the Doctor, just simply because he's a veteran, he's got the experience, Glass ups and still a little bit green, a little bit fresh, but no surprises, that's what wrestling's about, so we, we could see Tobias Upson win this match, and Dr. Karn looking a bit cocky on the ropes there, um, well Tobias Upson giving the crowd a little go, they, they didn't seem to react too much to it. Just having a little circle, and they're tying up. Oh, Doc, look at that! He's down! Tobias Epson using that chin lock, and oh, Karn's forward his way back out of it. You can't use such a textbook move on the Doctor. He's got all the reversals, and going into that front headlock. And, oh, the Doctor... Oh, damn, he's crashing him down with that overhead suplex. You know, gut wrench style, he, he just crushed him. You know, we can't see too much more of that, or this match could be over before it even begins. And Tobias Upson reversing it. That's all kicking his legs out. That was brutal. He's going for the early cutter and hope Tobias Upson grabs that rope and breaks the pin. I've you know, I've seen the doctor. He 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 went for that pin. He's just wearing Tobias Upson down. But the doctor charging. Boo! The impact. The head in Tobias Upson with that clothesline, that strong clothesline. Um he's locking him in. That abdominal stretch. Don Carr's really working that lower body already. We sort of dunked wrenches. Now we say, oh, Tobias Upson, flipping him over, a hip toss. Go for the cover. Make yourself famous, kid. What? All right, he's kicked out on the one count. You know, you can't get the doctor that easy. Tobias Upson's going to learn that the hard way if he keeps trying it. Tobias Upson, put him in the corner. Oh, this is one of his signature maneuvers, the Bionic Bulldog. Oh, the impact, crushing the doctor. He's going up top. The doctor's coming in. Oh, an overcastle. The doctor's down. Tobias Upson keeps up this offense. You know, he could be in a good place. Using the arm bar. Throwing him off the ropes. Oh, and another hip toss. But the thing I like about Upson, I see him in training. He, he's got a, he, the same move pull. But he'll, he'll use them to his advantage. Same hip tosses. Just, just working that lower back of Dr. 